Oh, here we go again. Here's a half gallon Atlas cannon jar. 150th Gettysburg um, anniversary bottle. Now, this is a shame here. This is one of these nice old uh, wire bell drawers, but they, they got the rim broke there a little bit. But I'm debating whether to just throw that out or uh, do something, make a craft out of it. I don't know what you'd call this, maybe a wine decanter. This one's pretty neat. Garrett's American Wines. And I mean, this bottle's fancy. That's probably about a gallon, gallon size. Yep, contents one gallon of Garrett's. So I'll clean that up and use that for one of my homemade wines. And an old brown, little brown jug of apple cider came from my Lucky Leaf. It's pretty neat. Here's a dandy. Look at that. That's good. Look at the big bubble in the glass. Nice old bowl jar. And I mean, it's nice. Just needs cleaned up. And a couple just regular pints. Then we got a half dozen of these. Bowl ideal. Um, wire bells. And these two are missing the glass lids, but I have glass lids. Because I still can in these things. I mean, they're safe to use. You still get the jar of rubbers. And when you clamp that down, when they're done cooking, you know it's sealed up. An old insulator, probably just leave it set in the yard as an ornament. And then these two uh, brass kerosene lamps. And right here on each side you can loosen that and they'll pivot and then the base has two screw holes that you can mount these on the wall and pivot in 90 degrees and make like a sconce light out of them but they're all there need a little polishing up but they're pretty nice but once again Got all that for free. All right. Hope everybody has a great weekend. See you again.